Hello and welcome to a long overdue episode of What's in Arthur's Bed. So we've had a few things to do with this week. It uh, meant we were a little bit late on getting this recorded. But we're here now and we're going through his bed. And luckily there's a lot in his bed this week. Last time I tried to record one of these there wasn't a lot to go through. So I decided not to put it through. So let's start going through what's in his bed. So Mr Pouch, you know, it is your getting up time and you've still not risen. Come on you two, we need to go for your bed. Yeah, we need to go for your bed. Oh, no, come on. All right, I managed to evacuate the pouches. I don't think I'm particularly happy about that. So let's see what you've gathered this week, Mr Pouch. Mrs. Pouch. This blanket of yours. Got some, uh, he's actually climbing up his cage to get back off. Uh. Right, we're just going to carry on off. Ooh, you've got some lovely wrapping paper there. It's a nice fetching Lego style wrapping paper. I think that was left over from wrapping some presents. He's just plonked himself back in the cage. Obviously weren't too happy with being pulled out, no. I know he made off of a lot of my letters. It's always concerning when you have letters that say that on the front. What is this? Hmm. That's some sort of weird packing thingy. And another important documents enclosed. Important information about your Sky Broadband service. Well, I'll, I'll have that. If I can have that. Oh, a train ticket. Oh, this is this rather fetching wrapping paper that you were sent, wasn't you, Arthur? You were sent some lovely wrapping paper, and I can see you've made a lovely bed from it. Yes, you have made a lovely bed from that. So how about we give you that back? We allow you to have that again, because you only took that last night. No, oh I know, I know. We're so we're mean humans taking all your bedding. You've got a carrier bag. Would you like to keep your carrier bags? You've got two carrier bags. Do you want to keep them both? Put them up there then. It's an invoice. <laughs> Ugh. That's an invoice for a car MOT. God, only a car's expensive. Right, well, yeah, I guess we don't need that off. That's fine. Chris Brackett. That, that's, that's some... That was some headphones. Well, they still seem to be in one piece, surprisingly. He's, he's squished something into them. Oh, well, that is it's green. Yeah. Well, what else we got off? What else we got? You got your dear old squeaky. Right, well, that can stay up there. Oh, we've got these beautiful scan bits of paper you took. To some of our Twitter followers and uh, Facebook followers might have seen, but he he walked onto my scanner last night, and at just the right moment, I hit the scan button and got a lovely scan of his foot. I was quite impressed with that, and he was so impressed with it he took it in his cave. Can we have the rest of what's Arthur? Off. You can mouth me all you want. It's going to make no difference. It's like, get away, get away, get away. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I have to take the stuff in your bed. Ugh. Is this going to mean you have a little ham wrestle? Can I fit in your pouch? Well, you've got smelly pouches. Smelly pouches. Well, I can keep your hand there. <laughs> no. Oh, Arthur, your pouches, they stink. And there's some safety instructions for something electronic he's stolen. Looks like a dispatch notice that he's actually stolen from... Uh, there's something to do with my work, surprisingly. Hmm. 
Must have stolen out my bag off. Oh, another carrier bag. What's this? It's a random receipt. No, stop trying to be like you're all aggressive because you're not scary. You're not scary. Hmm. Bank driver. I swear he's stealing basically everything to do with Sky that's come through the door over the last couple of days. Good job it's nothing important, eh? Ah, oh, that was the other one. I managed to hit it twice, the scanner, and I got one of a coloured foot. <laughs> We're not even halfway through, are we, off? Ah, because that's why I was scanning in the first place. So I had my hand on the scanner. <laughs> See if I could scan my hand. And then you jumped up wondering what I was doing, didn't you? What's this? Another letter. God, you've got every single sky letter. Another one. Oh, I'm going to stop showing because these sky letters are boring now. That's 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 three of them. Oh, that is a carrier bag. Shut up. It's a carrier bag. Do you really want that? Yeah. It's just a carrier bag. All right, I'll let you keep it. I'll let you keep it. Big block of seeds. Now we broke this up for you, didn't you? And you carried it all individually. Well, I'll let you keep that. God, we're not even... There's still loads in there, off. And you're guarding it. Come here. Come here. We can't clean your bed. No, we can't clean your bed while you're in it, can we? No. No, we can't. Go on. Go do something. Try and get through this. Oh, jeez. Oh, we've got a one of the raw mail delivery slips. It's obviously it comes to the door, and if we don't notice it, it's in his bed before we even realised. There's another full pack of baby wipes. He's carrying stuff off the floor up the cage now. That is a hole. Is this? Don't know what it was. Some sort of magazine that came through the door. Yeah, some sort of one of them local advertisement things that come through. That's just Pepsi Max shrink wrap. Hmm, something Claire's been ordering from H and M. And what I'm assuming was probably something from Primark. Our Temple driveways. This is basically all the leaflets that come through the door, and if they fall in the wrong place, we don't see them, and he does. Piano and guitar lessons. Imagine you playing guitar, Arthur. That is a sorry we missed you. And another sorry we missed you because I'm waiting for a package from APC and it's been two weeks and they still haven't managed to deliver it on time. Useless. Yoga. Would you like to do yoga off? Clearance sales. These are all sales leaflets. I was hoping there'd be a bit more interest in there, Arf. What's that? Oh, that's a price. Is that what you're worth? Where are you going, you dark patch? Well, that's... That's pretty much all of it. Let's let's quickly grab what's in the bottom of your cage, Arf, because there's not a lot. I can We've got, I swear we've had one of these before, because I remember there being a dog biscuit stuck to it, and now we've got we've got two of them this time. I guess they're trying, and the remains of the rather fetching rather fetching parcel that Arthur was sent through the post. Well off. I think that's it. That's all of the most of the stuff in your bed is utter utter crap this week. Yeah. Nothing else in the bottom? No? That's it. Right, well, I'll leave it there, folks. Thanks for watching.